Okay, another gorgeous day down here in downtown Portland and I am ready to ask some people about their scars and share the stories behind the scars, whether they're physical or emotional. I'm gonna see if I can get people to open up. I think this might be the start of a new series maybe. Yeah, I love talking to strangers and hearing their stories. So, wish me luck. Here we go. Hey, hey guys. Well, only on my chest. Only on your chest? Yeah, for my defibrillator. How long have you had the scar for? 10 years, 12 years. Okay, okay. Does it bother you or? No. You know, I'm just glad it works. Yeah, no kidding. <laughs> right, and you've been okay since? Yeah, I mean, I've had my ups and downs, but I'm not supposed to be walking right now. Oh, well, okay. <laughs> Exercise is good though, <laughs> sir, yeah. No, 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 I mean, I'm literally not supposed to be walking. Oh, you're not supposed to be alive? No. Oh my God. Did you have a massive heart attack? No, it was just that they couldn't, uh, they couldn't heal me. I was weighing 307 pounds, my legs were swollen, I had legs in cast, fluid running out of my legs, couldn't breathe, needed oxygen, and now they're taking away all that. I go to my doctor every day, he just shakes his head. I don't believe it, I say, well, no. You gotta believe in God first, that's the reason I'm still here. I mean, how much weight did you 230. lose? 230. Oh my God. Congratulations. Thank you. Good for you. Thank you. You have you have kids and grandkids? And... Oh, that's who I'm here with. Oh, exactly. But we're going on the boat trip and they're going someplace else to the gymnasium. Okay. So, okay. okay. Plenty. Scars, yeah. Emotional yeah. or physical? Which you ones are you talking about? Uh, I'd, well, of course, you know, both. But, you know, but it's really whatever yeah. you're willing to share. I have one right here. My little brother, or I was kind of being a brat. It was his. Was this yesterday? Yeah, it was a while ago. <laughs> <laughs> um, anyways, it was my turn to do the vacuuming, but I somehow convinced my mom to make him do it. I don't know what happened. And he had to come in, he was had his friend over. And then to top it off, um, he's, so he's doing my chore. I'm like putting my feet in front of him as he's vacuuming. <laughs> and he's getting pissed and he's telling me to stop. Um, but I didn't. And so he hit me with the vacuum cleaner hose. It was like when he was four or five, so okay. things have mellowed out. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Thank you for sharing. You Thank you so much for sharing. Do you want to Yeah, which one do you want? I've got like 50 of them. Really? Yeah. Well, this one is, that was BMX biking in Olympia oh, awesome. when I was like nine years old. And you're in a race, it's one, two, three. Yeah, right. So I tried to air the first one, miss the second one, land on the third, and there was half a hill gone. So I went over the handlebars and the brake stuck in my leg. I had, to, I had to push the bike a half a mile home by myself and passed out like three times. Uh, and how old were you when, when uh, that? Let me think. That was 91, so I would, had to have been 11. Good stories, guys. Thank awesome. You. Yeah. Thanks for, so much for sharing. Oh, yeah, you do. Um, a car accident. What happened? A car, a car accident. Um, <laughs> hit on collision, a couple of guys killed, car rolled over, caught on fire, so broken glass. No. Oh, goodness. Yeah, how old were you? Um, 18. 18? So you guys collided with another car? Yep. Or, and you guys rolled over? Yep. Caught, the car caught fire. Oh, the car caught fire? Yep. And that's all that happened to you? Yep. Yeah. Goodness, God, you got, you got lucky, didn't you? Was it? Goodness, how was everyone else? Uh, two, two dead, two um, quite badly scarred. Yep. Yeah. Oh, I'm so sorry. Like a friend? Or? Yep. Yes. Friend driving in the car. Yep. Gosh. And a person in the other car as well. Um, this is back in um, New Zealand. So, open road, 100 k's an hour. Oh, 100. Oh, okay. So, yeah, 64. Yes. Yeah. We've known each other since we were 15. Oh, what? Really? So, yes. And we've been married for 40 years. Congratulations. <laughs> Wow. Yeah, 74. Yeah, 74, I guess. Yeah, I guess so. Yeah. Still there. Yeah, no kidding. Yeah. I don't. No? Anybody here? I have one, like, it's a tiny one, though. <laughs> the youngest one here has a scar? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, it was kind of embarrassing of a story. But it's really up to you. To. you it's really up to you, then. I don't care. It's, it's kind of funny. Actually, I was, uh, I was changing one day in my room, in my closet, and so there's like little hinges on the doors. And, like when you close the door, like the latch, so it was like kind of sharp on the side. So then I picked my knee up when I was trying to put my underwear on and it just sliced my knee open. 
when like oh. it was pretty deep actually, but it was like it was weird. Putting on your underwear. <laughs> yeah, putting on your underwear. <laughs> I mean, it's not very big, but. Well, that was, yeah, that was about a year and a half. But it was but it was deep though, right? Yes, yeah, it was. Yeah, you could see muscle. Right. Oh wow. Okay. Yeah. Jeez. So thanks for uh, yeah. thanks for sharing and being so open. You yeah, know, no appreciate problem. that. Yeah, I have a kind of cool scar oh, on my yeah. lip. Yeah. Oh okay. Yeah. <laughs> okay. Cool. Cool. Um, I have this uh, scar right here. I don't know if you can see it. Okay. Got it. Thank you. Okay. So I um, had just learned to like go down this cool slide at this camp I used to go to, and my mom was riding by on on the Wave Runner, and I wanted to show her. So I ran out on the dock, and a wet dock means slippery. Nice. So I slipped and fell and whacked my face on the ladder to the slide, and I had the scar. Yeah, and how old were you? like 10. 10, okay, okay. Yep. So some days, for some reason, it's like way more prominent, and you can like really see it on my lip, and some days you can't. So it changes, that's interesting, it changes. Yeah. yeah. I do. You do? Yeah. That's from my twins. Oh, 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 you're, oh, yeah, right, right back there. Yeah. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. thank you, thank yeah. you. That's from my twin sister and I when we were little kids and we were crawling on top of a bed that was actually situated close to a glass door. And so my twin sister accidentally pushed me across the window and just like, I think my head went between the glasses and that's how I got the scar. So that's from glass? Yeah. Oh. Gosh. Yeah, so I think I had to get surgery to clean up the whole glasses shreds that were in there. And my dad told me like it was so severe that they just left like some pretty tiny shreds in there. I don't know what happened. But <laughs> that's the story. We're still kids. How old were you? Uh four years, three to four years. Oh so you don't remember? I don't remember. I got the story. Okay. Yeah. Did did you say your sister accidentally did it? Yes. Oh that's okay. what I was told. Uh, yeah, okay. Yeah. So, <laughs> okay. Yeah. Only one. I'm not gonna show it to you though. No? Okay, all right. Wouldn't be appropriate. Have a good day. Have a great day, sir. I have a scar here. Oh, well, you, you have really strong legs, dude. Wow. Well, not right there, because there's a big ass scar there. It's exactly in the same place and slightly larger than a scar that my grandmother had. So it's kind of freaky. Your and grandmother? It, yeah, and I didn't get it until I was, you know, in my 30s. So. Yeah, I, I had a little skin infection, and um, this guy um, at the hospital, I call him, was it Jacob? I think his name was Jacob, Jerome, something. He came in and he like whacked away at it, and it was really, really nasty. Yeah, there was some emotional things behind it, but we're not gonna go there right now. <laughs> okay, okay, gotcha. <laughs> Probably causing the infection. Hey guys, can I, I'm just doing a YouTube video. Can I please ask you just one question? Sure, yeah, why not? <laughs> Do you have any scars? No, I don't have any. I have like, I got a dent in my forehead. Yeah. It's not a scar, but you can feel like the chip in the skull. I was um, playing follow the leader when I was maybe like seven, and I jumped over this log and I actually flipped and then hit my head on a rock, and I had like blood just like going all over my face, but I totally didn't notice, and it healed up fine, but. So like I, when did you, someone else notice first? Yeah, someone else told me, and I could see the shock in their eyes, and then, <laughs> so then I went and looked in the mirror and there was just like blood pouring everywhere. Did you have to yeah. have stitches or go to the hospital? Or? No, it healed up by itself surprisingly. We were off on an island at the time, so we couldn't really get back to the.